Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you how to take a PDF document and edit the PDF document using Microsoft Word. Now by default, typically I edit my PDF documents with an Adobe software called Adobe Acrobat. But this is actually part of my Adobe Creative Cloud membership. So I pay for Photoshop, Illustrator, programs like that. And that comes with Adobe Acrobat which actually has a tool built into it to natively edit PDFs like this. So anything I wanna edit, changing images basically becomes very easy. But I know a lot of people don't have this paid option, but they do have Microsoft Word, maybe through Office 365, which I also have. So let me show you that. Let me close Adobe Acrobat Pro here. And this time, let's go ahead and open Microsoft Word. And inside of Microsoft Word from the homepage, I just went to the open tab right here. So go to the open tab and give it access to your computer here. If you have the PDF in OneDrive, if you use something like that, you could access it here. In this case, I have it right on my desktop. So I'm gonna go to my computer here and it's gonna open this dialog box and I'm gonna go ahead go to my desktop and choose that PDF document and press open. Now it's gonna convert that document to a Word document. Sometimes it also may ask for you to allow for this conversion to happen. So you may get a pop-up where you have to say allow. And here inside of this document, I could basically edit everything. So if I have a, a typo, for example, like here, I could go ahead and correct that typo just by right clicking and choosing from the correction. I could add a period if I missed one. I could go ahead and press and delete an entire row, for example, if you have a Word document that looks like this. So I could go ahead and press OK and it shifted it up like that. Now Adobe Acrobat is the native way of editing PDFs from Adobe. So it tends to work better from my experience, but this tends to do a good job. Let me just go ahead and undo that. And you could also go ahead and delete logos, for example, images. Sometimes with PDFs, that's a little bit heavy on graphics. It doesn't do as good of a job, but with word-based and just simple graphics on a PDF, it will do a pretty good job with editing anything. And once you're done with your edit, you'll just have to come up to file, save as, and instead of saving it as the Word document that it is right now, you could go ahead and change that to a PDF and export it out as the PDF. So it could overwrite the original PDF that you opened up. And it's that simple to edit PDF documents inside of Microsoft Word. I hope you found this useful. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for easy to follow tech videos just like this one. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.